After much karmic clearing, the eclipse has created a tornado effect in our lives, releasing dense energies, karmic attachments, bringing up imbalances in our relationships, purging old emotions, constructs, and programs that are actually limiting our soul's growth to give us the freedom we desire. There is no going back, only forward into the unknown. Letting go of control and surrendering into the unknown. Feeling safe and secure in our comfort zone is not a space where the soul can grow. Change, growth and new experience is how the soul evolves and grows and learns. How are we holding ourselves back from our inner truth? How are we limiting our truth? Are we being truthful, transparent and authentic in our communication with others and ourselves? Are we speaking with integrity, honesty and vulnerability? As this is a space for true healing and transformation to take place. This is the energy of now during these monumental times of transition here on earth. The soul is emerging ever stronger through our human vessel and we are in a push and pull phase of letting go of the old ways to embrace a very new way. The new ways they may feel scary, new territory we haven't explored before, bringing up all our insecurities and vulnerabilities and yet still the soul gently guides us to keep stepping forward and listening to our hearts, listening to our truth. Change is never comfortable, yet change is here and we have entered a very new cycle. Through the chaos and confusion, clarity does come and we will get lots of clarity and aha moments and deeper revelations this August of what is unfolding in our lives and why we had to release what we did to make space for what's about to emerge. We are evolving, growing and birthing something very new and labor pains are incredibly painful. But what comes after are the miracles of life. Beyond the illusion of pain and suffering, there is deep love, connection, beauty, magic, and life. The transition towards unity consciousness and moving away from separation, it's easier to speak about in theory, but bringing it through and actually grounding it into our reality requires courage, deep reflection, grace, kindness, compassion, and gentleness as we navigate our lives through the unknown. Meditation is a great tool to use during these times to take you out of your situation to become the bird on the branch of a tree and the observer. We are all orchestrators of our reality. We are all creators. What have we come to learn? How can we let go of attachment so that we can move beyond suffering? Life will bring us many challenges to help us grow. We cannot stay in the same size part and wonder why life has not flowed. We must also repot our soil to grow into the expanded version of ourselves, ever closer to our true selves. The soul is learning, the soul is growing, we are evolving and birthing something very new. We are the writers of the script and we will leave our legacy for generations to come of how we liberated ourselves 
to become our true selves, transparent, whole and pure, to become all soul. The golden age, we have talked about this for so long and here we are, we are in it, building new structures of love, compassion, community and care. We are uniting, yet still in our human form, experiencing separation, but desiring unity within. Torn between separation and oneness, moments of overwhelming feelings of love, and then logic kicks in. Sometimes not having a clue what's going on, but continually surrendering to the process and taking one step and one day at a time. We are moving towards a new consciousness beyond anything we have known. We encourage you to keep going for love is the key that opens all the locks. Love is the key in the language of the heart. It whispers gently, reassuring us that all is well and yet the mind fears stepping forward into the unknown. Navigate one step at a time, one day at a time, towards a new horizon beyond the veil. This horizon will show us that love was there all along, that we were never really alone, that we haven't lost anything, but gained more than we could ever have imagined that the abundant universe has gifted us the real miracles of life. If only I could avoid the pain, says the human. But dear one, the pain is what opens the heart. It cracks open the heart so deeply and there lies the sweet nectar, pure and sweet, unconditional love. It is the brave ones who embark on this journey. Pat yourselves on the back, take a deep breath and keep going. And before you know it, you will see the greater tapestry unfolding before your very own eyes. We send you our blessings. We send you our love. We are the family of light.